to is Lego Masters, and today we're gonna be doing uh, um, Lego and Dragon Movie, Lego movie. Um, um, review set. set. And it's a bomber. And it's the Manta Ray bomber. And um, oh yeah, I forgot. We're gonna have this little drama for Mega Star Wars in our videos. Whoever finds them gets to have a shout out from us in the description below. And please try to. Um, hit the like button. We're gonna try to get 1,000 likes by the end of this year, which is 2017. <sighs> Please and thank you. Okay, first let's get started with the minifigs. Left to right, we have Cole, the water guy. We accidentally forgot his name because my brother accidentally threw away the box on accident. I forgive him though. Then we have a shark warrior and a shark warrior and a shark costume. Okay, now let's get into more detail. Okay, first up we have Cole. He he's a ninja in the movie, and he comes with this um, warhammer, and his mask is a double-sided mask. Hold on, as you can tell, there's the bottom half of his mask. It's double-sided. Let's wait for the camera to adjust. But I like his torso. torso. It um, shimmers in the light. It's like a golden robe like torso. And his printing on his pants are really good. But I wish they also put on the bracelets that he has in the movie on the set. The set. Okay. Okay. Next up we have this water guy. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys. Cole has two facial expressions. One's a happy a happy face and the other's like a mad face. Let me show you real quick. Okay. Anywho, let's get on with this mini food again. We call him the water boy because we accidentally threw away the box as we said before. And here he has a frightened face. And I like the robe that he's wearing. Yeah. And this thing, the, he's not really holding it. It's attached to him on the back. He has a nice hat. Which I haven't really seen before. But yeah. Let's just take off that. His head. Oh, where does his head go? Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on. There you go. Here you go. Here's his thing. His water bucket thing. Okay, we just put that back on. Okay, my brother keeps picking up stuff that I tell him not to. Well, he's actually kind of helpful. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it for this guy. Up next, we have the shark warrior. He has a fish, rep fish with a sword, with a drill for a weapon, and he has a he has a weird facial expression, which I hope is used in other sets as well. And I like this new hat color, if it's new. Can you put away the sword? Put away the sword. Okay. And he has this, he has the same, well, I'm going to say the same. He has the torso printing, which is really cool. It's like a life support pack. And then he has the back too. Hey, yeah, look back here. You can really see it's really good. As you can see, it looks really good on him. Yeah. On to our next mini. Next, we have the shark warrior in a shark warrior suit. Let's just take off that. He has this mad facial expression, which is pretty cool with the giant eyebrows. And he also has another fish weapon, like the previous one. And he has the same torso and leg printing as the other one. And let me just give you a close up of the helmet. This is helmet. It's a shark, great white shark, I think. It just goes on his head. And it has a low battery percentage. Hutchin has an actually nice feature that I don't know, 
And he also had this back suit. Um, I'd say it's pretty good from to me. Okay. Um. Okay, so now on to the big set. Here's the Manta Ray Bomber, and it's full, and it's full building stage. Sorry about that, a family calling, so I had to pause the video. But anywho, let's get started with this bad boy. Okay, first of all, it has the two shrimp things first, I think. He has, it comes with this little boat with these little um, levers and it has this little machine gun attached to it which is pretty cool oh as you can see the the scope on here this piece it actually magnifies let me see if I can get a closer look at that Hold on. oh yeah look you can see the little peg on here yeah okay Okay, and now, it's cool, I have these little bombs on it that can come off. Looks like a bee, but it's actually a warning for, to, the, to, his, to his buddies, I guess. And you can just put them back on here. Oh, and I forgot to mention, these fall off easily. These are used to like an anchor. Anywho, this is used like an anchor to hold the minifig down. Time to get on the big set. Okay. Okay, here's the mantle. I'll give you a little time to look at it. Sorry for the horrible cameramanship. It's my first time doing, second time doing the video. Like well, guys, if you guys haven't seen our first video, go check it out. It is amazing. It's three simple weapons. Anyways, let's get back to building. I mean, not building. Showing you. These little knobs right here. They attach to these spinning little shooters. Which you can pull. And then they shoot out. Which is pretty cool to me. And these, well, these paddles, they're on it. On it right here, they're just attached by this little bar bar holder. And in the picture of the set, I think it's used for the bad guy to use. Then you have these little propeller jets in the back here, which turn and spin. And these can actually come off. <laughs> Would you look at that, guys? These can come off. And in the movie, I'm sorry if I'm spoiling this for you guys. But these are bombs. Dude, I'm sorry if I'm spoiling it. So sorry if I am. Anyways, let's get back on. And that's about it. It has a logo 26. Well, not a logo, a tag. And it has these white symbols right here, like the lights. And then it has these warning stickers on it. Which makes it... So then they know that that's going to trigger it and it's going to fire. Okay guys. Okay guys, we're going to do a little clip. And we're going to show you a weapon. If you watched the previous video, you'll know what it is. You have five seconds to guess. One. Time's up. And in the comments below, tell us what it was. Okay, thank you. Why did I pause it? Okay, anywho, this is the complete set 